Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So we're going to revolve this area. We are going to revolve this area 360 degrees along the y equals 2 line. So we're going to revolve 360. So it will look something like this. Work out the volume of this solid. Okay, so uh, so press pause and have a go. Okay, so to do to do this, we we ultimately want to integrate from from here from here to uh, to here. So we need this location and we need this location. So so let's try and identify these these two locations. So looking at this, um, rearrange it. So add x squared to both sides. That will then give you this, and then square root both sides. When you square root, you, you're going to get a positive version and a negative version. Well, the positive version will be this. The negative version will be this. But we don't really care about the negative version. So, so let's just look at the, the positive version. So we've got this thing here, 1 plus x squared. So if you want to, if you want to know this location and this location, set y to be 2. So put 2 into there. So that will then give you this. Um, square both sides, that will then give you this, um, and then take away 1, well, x equals uh, uh, square root of positive negative 3. So, so ultimately, we, we want to integrate from negative uh, square root of 3 to positive square root of, um, of 3. But rather than doing it from here to here, because it's symmetrical, let's, let's do it from 0 to um, to positive 3. So our volume would be 2 times uh, from 0 to um, to positive uh, square root of 3. So rather than doing this, it's easier to do it from 0 to here and then later times 2 because it's symmetrical. So um, so we, we're just going to do this and then later times 2. So let's let's try and come up with a formula for, for the volume. So volume equals, we're going to integrate it from, from 0 to root Three and whatever the answer is, we're going to times it by two later on. So from from zero to root three, and then um, so we're, we're moving along like this. Um, we need to know the uh, the radius at, at this particular point. The, well, the radius will be given by by the whole height here, which will be two, and then take away take away this thing here from here to here. So take away. Uh, Take away what was it uh, earlier was y equals one plus x squared square root. So it would be um, it would be uh, root one plus x squared. Um, so 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 this thing here, this thing here will give us the height. This thing here will give us the height as we're moving along. It will give us the distance from here to here. So now we need to pi or square it because we we, we want to rotate it. Um, along here. So so we need to pi r square it to give us the area of the disk. So it's going to be pi r, this is our r here, squared. And and we're we're, we're moving in the x direction. So so the thickness here will be dx dx. So um so the volume will be given by by this. So the volume will be given by uh by this. Okay. Um I will continue in the next video. Okay.